Okay guys, so right where my hand, my finger is at, is right where I took the bolt out to get you in reference. You see the starter's kind of hanging here. But now how you get this thing out, if you look way back into this cavern here, there's plenty of room. Like it just goes and goes and goes. Let me put my hand back here. See? It just goes, goes, goes. So kind of tilt it back toward there once you take that um, 15 millimeter out and kind of work it and jiggle it. And uh, of course you're probably going to see the little ring come off the gasket which by the way taking a look at I do see some ah there it is I see a little bit of wet oil it should not be present um a little further examination I do see some oil leakage around here all the way through the back anyway not to be getting off beat but I will dress that at a later time if we're going to dress it at all um Okay, so now we've wiggled this out, and all we really have is a 13 millimeter bolt right here, which connects the, you see the power right here, going right here. This thing grounds through the bolt, so not a ground, this is all hot. This is why you want to disconnect the battery, guys. And if you look at the little switch going to the solenoid right here at the end of the little wire, that just pulls off. So that's what I'm going to do now. I'm going to pull that off, and um, I'm going to disconnect this 13 millimeter, switch it out, and away she goes. But guys, that's all there really is to this little starter situation. And of course, you can clearly see that it's going to pass the O2 sensor. So I would disconnect the O2 sensor, but I wouldn't take the time to actually take it out. Um, uh, what was that? Six bolts, 15 millimeter. And you need a 10 millimeter for the heat shield. 13 millimeter for this. A uh, pair of little cutters to take the little clip off of the end of this. That's about it guys. I think that's going to wrap it up on the starter. Now keep in mind, safety is a big deal under here. As you see, we are secured, secured, secured. I mean, we are we are taking safety very serious. You're under a car. Um, meanwhile, I can't think of anything else that would impede you from doing this job. Just be patient. It will take some wiggle and jiggling to get out, get out the starter. It took me about a minute and a half. Usually some of these things just fall right out, so that's that's a little bit of effort. Uh, meanwhile, subscribe, smash the like button if you like it, guys. I've got some more stuff coming out. Keep in mind this is on a playlist for Sebrings. If you have a Sebring, by all means, subscribe, go to the playlist, and make it your favorite. Because I think the list just grows with Chrysler's because there is so many problems. Ha ha. Meanwhile, nothing but love from the car man. See you on the next flip.